M0FXB. So open spot four or open spot four pro. So I didn't realize they had made two. So it seems to me like the open spot four is a faster device. And I can't really see any obvious uh, changes, but if we look at this section here, what is the difference between the open spot four and the open spot four pro? So what I'm looking at here is Let's just read the whole section. The OpenSpot 4 is a whole new device with the latest technology improvements. Built-in battery, beeper, Wi-Fi support, USB-C, high tolerance power supply with fast charge support, built-in Wi-Fi and UHF antenna, 0.5 ppm TCXO with factory calibrations for very low BER. The OpenSpot 4 Pro extends the feature set of the OpenSpot 4 with built-in voice transcoding hardware. So does that mean that you can use the device, connect to the device, um, with what, using a D-Star radio that's transcoding, for example, to DMR without having it connected to the internet? Is that what that means? Because I'd like to know, has anyone else read this section? What does it actually mean? And then we'll just read the last bit. Most of the software components were redesigned to make the whole device extremely fast, future-proof, and use every little power. We've added a new radio, we've added new radio modes and network protocols since the OpenSpot 1. The web interface is re redesigned na and now uses WebSockets technology, which means extreme low latency and a whole lot of new real-time features so let's just see how this all unfolds We're waiting to see really so open spot 4 and they're, they're doing a special price 249 euros on the 26th of may and then it goes up to 319 euros 73 all the best